Good morning friends. Happy Sunday. Welcome back to this channel Vikas 10x Fitness Club. Well friends, today I am going to make you visit my organic oyster mushroom farm. Yes, we have already covered this organic farm in my previous videos. But I'm today I am going to show you the mushrooms, how these mushrooms are growing and uh, what's the color of the mushrooms, how many bits are there and uh, uh, means uh, how many beds I have laid down in this organic mushroom farm. See organic mushrooms are the superfood and no doubt in the coming future in the next generation we are going to have this as a major food and we all know the benefits of this oyster organic mushrooms isn't it so everybody loves mushrooms so let's move inside the mushroom farm friends here you can see this is the mushroom farm two these are the bags See? Yes. And in this farm, I have covered almost 500 bags. This basically we call it a bed. Here you can see. See, mushrooms are fruiting right now. And after one day, we can harvest this one. How mushrooms grow. Isn't it? Isn't it? Nice. Yeah, you can see. These are the mushrooms. This is basically called Brutus ostritus. This is the scientific name of this mushroom. Yeah, see, these are the beds. Mushrooms are good. Now you can see that uh, this bed is completely white. This white portion is called the mycelium growth. Yes, when we sow the spawn, spawn, that seed of that mushroom, it turns into a whole white color. It almost takes 15 days to get white in color, to get mycelium to run. And after 15 days, it starts fruiting. So basically, it takes almost 30 days to get fruiting. It has the two stages. One is uh, that we call it as a vegetative state and other 15 days we call it the fruiting state yes yes you can see the mushrooms are doing this is one sort of breed white oyster we call it see the whole uh, farm is the beds are covered white these are the mushrooms See friends, these are completely organic mushrooms as uh, I've used this steam and boiling method. So there are no chemical, no formalin, no bevestin. Uh, it took a little hard work as I have deployed a lot many people. See, this is, we call it a different breed and this is pink oyster. Yes, these are pink in color. You see, I can show you this. Go to the other side. Here you can see, these are the pink bricks. And this, the scientific name of this one is Pyrrhus Zemo. So friend, this is a walk around of my uh, farm <laughs> and uh, <coughs> and uh, not to discuss much more about these organic mushrooms as we all know that these mushrooms are rich in low, uh, rich in high water content, rich in fiber and good amount of protein and these are to be very precise low calorie food and if we use this in our diet then of course we are going to have our 
flat belly and we are going to get rid of all sort of lifestyle diseases yes these are basically also helpful in overcoming all sort of lifestyle diseases like diabetes bp sugar <coughs> yes you see obesity nowadays obesity is a major challenge this has this is low calorie food and uh, it has low fat low cholesterol and vitamins minerals vitamin d is there and this mushrooms and we know that vitamin d yeah. and apart from this one the, it has antioxidants and antioxidants like selenium which helps to protect our body from damages or the when the cell gets damaged it helps to protect and uh, you see the complete visit of this one so friends uh, the benefits if i talk about it prevents cancer and it is good for heart health and it is also helps in anti aging and of course it regulates the digestive system as well and uh, last but not the least is it boosts the immune system so hope you enjoyed this video and this is somewhat the organic mushroom that i would i would urge i would request everybody to grow in their home see this is the water pump over here yes this is the water pump from here uh, we are taking water and this water gets sprayed from the top portion these are the fogos i have installed these fogos as well to maintain the humidity and temperature over here here you can see this is the upper portion of this farm and you can see one more thing that the complete farm is made up of bamboos and uh, paddy straws and uh, that <coughs> shed net and here i have installed one meter this is hygrometer where you will see the temperature meter temperature reading the humidity and the timing as well so i i have tried this farm to give it a flavor of a uh, village so that rural rural type so friends i hope you have enjoyed the video and uh, everyone should grow mushrooms in their home as well organic mushrooms so thank you thanks to all of you stay safe keep acting keep growing this is vikas bye bye